Hey, let me show you how we can adjust the display settings and how we can find them on the Samsung Galaxy A35 5G. So all you have to do is just to move into the settings. Now scroll down a little bit and go into the display. Now from this, we can switch the light and the dark mode. When you go into the dark mode settings, we can even turn it on as a schedule from sunset to sunrise or pick custom schedule. When we go back from this one, we can also change the brightness level manually and we can turn on and off the adaptive brightness. From this, we've got also the motion smoothness, so we can get 60 Hz or go for the adaptives, adaptive from 60 to 120. From this, we can turn on and off the night light filter, the basic the blue light filter. We've got the screen mode, we can change between screen, uh, between the vivid natural, and we can also change the white balance. And for the mode advanced settings, we've got the RGB palette colors. And now from this, we got also the font size and the font style. So with this, we can change the text size. Uh, by here, we can get the bold font. And by going into the font style, uh, we can actually change between the default font styles and we can even download, download the additional. From this, we've got the screen zoom. So uh, we can actually move it make it bigger or smaller, the whole interface, including the icons. Right here, we can hide the camera cutout for the specific application. From this, we can also change the screen timeout, keep screen on while viewing. And here we can activate or deactivate the easy mode. We can also turn on and off the edge panel that appears just right here. From this, we can also customize it to our own preferences. We can also change the navigation system, like we can get the free buttons navigation, the swipe gestures, we can turn on and off the assistant shortcut. There we go. And from this, we can also find the accidental touch protection, and we can turn on and off the touch sensitivity. We can also show or hide the charging information on the OLED in display and we can turn on the different screen savers. And that's how it looks right now. Please subscribe.